Parents should know that any camp allowing kids to come back this summer have gotten written approval that their COVID-19 control plan has been approved. Parents should just do what they've been doing. Be careful for their kids. As parents pack their child's bag for summer camp with things like water, sunscreen, and bug spray, don't forget to add hand sanitizer and a face mask. New summer camp regulations state children attending summer camp in Rhode Island will be required to have masks for some parts of their day, like pick up and drop off. When you drop off your child, they should be prepared to be verbally screened for symptoms. Camps can also opt to perform temperature checks. Plus, kids and staff will be kept in stable groups of 15. The emergency regulations say, like in your own household, within stable groups, it's not reasonable to require masks to be worn at all times. Last month, the president of the Rhode Island Association of Camps told us she and other camp leaders have been preparing for camp to look different this summer. And we're okay with that. We just hope that we can, you know, be a good resource for parents and um, get the kids back out and outside and enjoying nature again. There may be times when these groups are in a large area together, but but expect to see barriers or partitions separating each group. The guidance says a distance of 14 feet must be kept between them and limited use of sharing equipment is allowed. You can also expect increased cleaning, sanitizing and disinfecting and that also includes increased hand washing throughout the day too. I'm Alexandra Leslie, Eyewitness News.